Okay. Uh, remember, we are not going to let you go before you offload everything that we have. Okay. <laughs> we are I'll, here to I'll learn try, from I'll you. Try. I'll try. I'll try. I'll try. Yeah. All right. Take us through staple coins. What are staple okay. coins? How okay. are they going to change the crypto industry? Okay. So first, um, I'll, I'd like to just start with cryptocurrencies, right? So um, if you look at cryptocurrencies, these are more of um, digital currencies, I'll say, because they, they produce electronically through different methods, right? And we can't go into that right now. But um, so these are and some examples. I think the most common one is um, Bitcoin. Right? A lot of people are familiar with Bitcoin. And then we have Ethereum. There are over 5,000 cryptocurrencies. So, well, I can't afford to name all of them. But um, the issue that was was actually identified was, was the volatility, right? And that is the price going up and down. So, at one point, there was, there was a time Bitcoin went to 20,000, right? There was a time that Bitcoin dropped to 3,000. So, now imagine if you had bought Bitcoin when it was 20,000 and then it dropped to 3,000. You are, you, you, you'd be depressed, right? You would even think Bitcoin is a scam. But Bitcoin has done nothing wrong. It's not a scam. It's, it's a currency, right? But because of that uh, price fluctuation, and there are so many factors, I normally say, um, I say if you, have, if you have dollars, right, what's going to happen is that today the dollar price could be very, very high. Maybe you bought your dollar at 17 rands, right? And then two days back, uh, two days from, from, from then, the, the dollar price goes to 15, right? There you've lost some money. But if you bought it at 15 and it goes to 17, you feel like, oh, I've gained some money, right? It's the same thing. But the only thing is that the, um, the volatility in cryptocurrencies was just, it, 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 it was really, really um, crazy, right? And, um, and it affected a lot of people, especially it also affected adoption of cryptocurrencies because if I am um, a merchant and I'm selling products, and accept Bitcoin, right? When I accept Bitcoin, maybe it was ten. Um, it was ten. Ten. It was a thousand dollars for Bitcoin, right? And the price goes down. Goes down to um, five hundred dollars. I'm going to feel like I'm losing money. So if it goes up, well, I'm happy. I made more than my profit. So um, look, talking about stable coins. Stable coins are actually cryptocurrencies that have been really designed to minimize the volatility, right? The up and down in price of cryptocurrencies. So really stable coins are usually um, asset backed. And what I mean asset backed is that maybe they could be backed by, um, by the dollar, you know, they could be backed by um, maybe an asset like gold or diamonds. And um, this is to 